you love that play that they scored on because like everything worked so well, like all the linemen and everything. Did you see that as like as you were? Yeah, most definitely. I mean, I, I feel like everybody collectively did their job, even, you know, the play call. I feel like it was a great play call. They were sending the house, you know what I'm saying? I kind of set them up with the block. The linemen were downfield, the receivers blocking. It just, you know what I'm saying? It was collectively a good job. Do you guys anticipate them sending pressure in that moment? It was like something that you talked about pre play? I mean, we didn't really talk about it. I'm, I'm guessing Coach kind of kind of knew, you feel me? So I, he just put us in that position to be able to make that play. How do you like the role you've developed here? Because it's not like a traditional get the ball 20 times or something like that, but you do so many different things. Do you enjoy that? Oh, yeah, most definitely. I'm, I'm a guy who just wants to be able to help the team win or contribute however I can, you know what I'm saying? So if me being in the slot or, you know, in the backfield on punt, punt pressure, anything, wherever wherever I can help, I'm, I'm ready to step up. There was a lot of talk in that game about the physicality of it. Do you feel that the team kind of wore deep down as the game went on? I mean, most definitely. I, I still feel like a lot of people don't train like we do. So that physicality and for, for such a long time, you know what I'm saying? Hey, if, you, if you're not built, built like us, then, you know, we're built by storms. So, you know what I'm saying? A little different. I feel like running back, you, you think of it as being like a rhythm position. You have to be out there and develop a rhythm. Have, have you found a way to be able to instantly impact the game with a limited sort of opportunity to do that? Honestly, yeah, I mean, I do feel like coach coach does a lot of setting up. Like he, he puts us in the position to be able to make the play, and we just have to do that. And most of the time, I'm you know we know where our our, our touches are you know limited sometimes, so we, we just got to make the most of every one. So yeah, whenever I whenever I do get that opportunity, I'm more more than ready. Most likely, I ain't even gonna lie. Coach, I think it was Coach Atkins said that um, in one of the scrimmages, maybe you guys were getting thin at running back, but, and I think they they wanted to put you in green, but you were like, no. Be live. Do you remember that? And like, what's yeah. The yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we just want to be able to make sure we we get that feel of the contact, and you know, we don't really running back. You got to be physical, so it's, you know what I'm saying. We're trying to hit. We need, we need that. We need that every day. For sure. Was it cool to see Kaziah get that touchdown? Oh yeah. man, I was so happy, man. I was so happy for my guy. He definitely. I mean, I was happy for the whole team. Just the way the play played out, anyway. You know what I'm saying? We all blocking on the perimeter. You know, just showing that identity, showing that we really want it. Rod scored, scored late as well. Kind of put the, I mean, it's not how you see both him and him because I had comment. Just, I mean, when you when the, the group is all contributing and deep as the group is, what's that do for the running back room? I mean, I, it just brings so much different things to the table. We're able, we're able to, you know, everybody has their own strength, and we're able to we're able to use their strengths in different ways. So I feel like it's just a lot of stuff that a, a defense has to defend. When you guys go down in that game, 10 nothing, 17 7, what's the sideline like? Is anybody panicking? And a lot of talk about the leadership and how everyone kind of kept their heads the whole time. I mean, I feel like we got some good leaders, you know, myself, counting myself. And uh, I feel like we just got to keep that energy up. We always keep the next play mindset and we're ready to attack. You know what I'm saying? And even no, no matter what's happening, when that next play, we're coming to attack. You guys were down to 17 7, it was a pick six. Um, how big was that for momentum, that Deuce Band return? Oh, man. I was so happy for Deuce, too, man. You know, able to show his speed. You know what I'm saying? No, I definitely. I, that's a big play, big time. So I, I was definitely happy about that. Mark, you guys scheduled to start out with LSU. And with guys like Clemson, Coach talks about it's always about you guys. It's not about the opponent. Is that something you guys have kind of discovered to play with and have that focus this year? Or is that something that you might have had to do? And that was my first time. I mean, honestly, I, I kind of, myself, I've always had that, that mindset. You know what I'm saying? Uh, it doesn't really matter who we're playing. If we go out there and play our best game, then yeah, it doesn't really matter what kind of happens. So that's my mindset, and I feel like the team is definitely, like, definitely jumping along, you know, coming along with that. So I feel like that's a good thing as well. When we see how much, uh, much time y'all spend on special teams and practice every day we're out here, how, how nice is it? I mean, all that work you put in, see it pay dividends like it did on that kick return. I mean, it's great, man. It just shows how, how the hard work will pay off, man. You know what I'm saying? We're putting it in every day, and things it's just happening in front, in front of us, so we're just happy about that. There's a, you know, you've had some big plays, so I'm sure friends and family and people are like, I don't think you're the ball more and stuff like that. What do you, what do you tell them? And like, I mean, honestly, you know, we're just trying to win. And if I'm being honest with you, you know, if, it, if I'm scoring, I'm scoring. If, it, if, if Rod's scoring, he's scoring. Or Kaziah, Trey, you know what I'm saying? So it kind of just goes wherever, you know, however it happens. God, That's God's, you know, decision. But 
I just want us to be able to win. Like that, that, that's my main thing. I ain't gonna lie. Coach Norvell, shout out the fan base Saturday night and again on Monday. Can you talk about the atmosphere on Saturday night. Oh man, it was crazy. Yeah, the fans definitely played a part in the game. You know, they helped us out, gave us that extra little energy push. So I feel like they they played a part for sure. Did you embrace uh, special teams when you first got here, or did you get it growing? Oh, I mean, I've always been in and out of the special teams, always been maybe a two guy, you know, six string or where, really wherever. I, I kind of played almost everywhere, but I, I never really started until, like, I would say last year, my pressure. That's probably my main thing, for sure. What's your role? What's my role? I mean, I'm clearing the fake and, and blocking for the play, really, like, most dangerous man. I don't have, like, a certain guy. I'm just kind of, like, getting started. What if uh, oh, one, sorry, one more. My bad. Good. <laughs> what well, you mentioned, like the running backs being happy for each other. Uh, you mentioned there's like a not a there's not a, there's an infinite amount of touches to go around. So like you know you have to. I guess basically, how do you guys manage to talk about being comfortable for each other, happy for each other? Oh man, we. I ain't gonna lie, man. We, we really support each other. Like we 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 lean on each other. So whenever a running back's going through something in our group. We, we lift him up, you know what I'm saying? We always make, make sure that he's ready because you never know what can happen, you know? So if, if, if somebody has the hot hand and the other guy's sitting, you know, he, he keep him going, keep him loose, and keep his mind right for when it is his time, he, he can be able to take over. So I, I kind of feel like it's kind of everywhere right now. So, you know, and we're, we're rolling on a high. You know, we just got to stay on it every day, keep getting better. Yes, sir.